Good morning, everyone. It's Jana here. Welcome to another live. Um, I hope everybody is doing great. Uh, it's another beautiful morning here in England. Um, it's been a good week. Um, I had an amazing, I had an amazing week. Um, every day, uh, every morning, I said to myself, it's going to be an amazing day today. And every day I had an amazing day. Because uh, as I have said many, many, many times, you attract what you are. Um, when you wake up in the morning and say to yourself that you're going to have an amazing day, you're going to have an amazing day. If you say to yourself that you're going to have a bad day, you're going to have a bad day. So which one do you think sounds better? Few announcements. Um, I there is a new uh, video on my YouTube channel. I interviewed an amazing, amazing lady. Her name is Jody. Uh, Jody is from America. It's absolutely incredible um, that I'm connecting with people from all over the world. Um, it was an amazing conversation. We had an amazing conversation with Jody. I am so so happy that I connected with her. Um, I wanted to talk about today, uh, I want to talk about friendships and connections with people. Um, I met a lot of people uh, on social media over the last four years. Um, and at the same time, I lost friends that I've known for many, many years. It's like I found my tribe on social media um, and my new friends, let's just call them, they're from all over the world. I haven't met face to face, with, actually only with one of them I have met face to face um, with the amazing Rebecca Adams. Hello Rebecca if you're watching. And um, it was so surreal when we met for the first time because um, we, we communicate all the time with Rebecca. We've collaborated many times and all of a sudden, oh, we, we meet face to face. Um, it was pretty incredible. But uh, with, um, I haven't met with anyone else face to face, but I am looking forward to meeting um, my soul sisters Debbie and Hazel. Um, Debbie and Hazel did an incredible live on TikTok last night. Um, if you want to find out about what they do, look for Ask Hazel and Divine Debra on TikTok. They are both absolutely amazing. Um, Hazel is also, as I like to call her, my marketing manager. She is absolutely fantastic when it comes to social media uh, management, SEO, websites, and any techy techy stuff. Because I'm, I, I don't like to, to to work on technology, and, and Hazel is pretty good at this. And Debbie, she is, um, she's an amazing, very gifted um, psychic incredible healer um she's been by my side on my healing journey since may last year and these two women debbie and hazel they're absolutely incredible um i'm so grateful that i'm able to connect with so many amazing people um if you go to my youtube channel i have um, a lot of videos uh with like-minded souls and the uh, purpose of my YouTube channel is, is the same with, with my TikTok channel and my blog and my social media, is to inspire and empower people. Um, so, um, what was I going to say? Um, yes, so all these people that I met on social media, even though I've never met face to face, they are closer to me and I have a lot more in common with them than with the people I've known for many many years isn't it that interesting um, over the years I left a lot of people behind but that's just life isn't it um, 
everything happens for a reason. When the universe removes something, uh, it's because something better will come in its place. And um, as we evolve and we grow spiritually, um, we move into a higher frequency. And as you move into a higher frequency, you will attract people that match your frequency. So um, I'm a very spiritual woman. Um, and having a conversation, as I like to say, a, a 3D conversation, it's very alien to me now. And I rarely have that kind of conversations uh, with people. Uh, maybe sometime when I'm in the supermarket, when I meet someone, you know, just have a quick chat about the weather. Uh, but in general, I prefer to have spiritual conversation with spiritual people. Uh, saying that, um, not all people that, that claim to be spiritual are spiritual. Some of them are, what was the expression, uh, wolf in sheep skin. Um, unfortunately, there is no way, maybe there is a way as you grow spiritually to recognize uh, who is real and who isn't. Um, but it, this is part of the journey, this is part of the, um, part of the spiritual growth, um, is learning to recognize uh, who to trust and to choose your inner peace over someone who is trying to take away your inner peace. Um, it happened to me uh, not long ago, um, actually two, three weeks ago, um, a so-called friend of mine who I thought was um, awakened and spiritual like me, um, I was absolutely shocked by his behavior and um, I thought you know what I, I can't be bothered with this nonsense so that was the end of our friendship um, years ago I would have given him a second chance a third chance and so on and so on but the truth is the more chances you give the people the more um, the more you give your power away and you disrespect yourself. If people don't change and become better version of yourself, there's nothing you can do about it. And if they continue to disrespect you, why do you keep them in your life? Um, so, you know, it, I'm so actually proud of myself that I'm not afraid to let go of, I'm not afraid to let go of people anymore. Yeah. And, um, I'm so proud of myself for choosing me because when you choose you, everything changes for the better. Your life will become better. Um, so um, I think that's all I want to talk about today. Uh, it's about friendships. I, uh, I'm not going to touch on uh, soulmate relationship uh, on today's live. Um, it might get a bit too much information. Uh, I might leave it for another life, but um, I, and, I, and the thing is, I'm I'm so proud and so happy with all all the people I've met online, and I collaborate with some of these people. Um, I've collaborated um, in the past um, YouTube recordings, for example, um, and. It's great. It's great when small businesses um, share um, energy and um, work together to empower and inspire people. Um, as energy workers, it's our duty to shine a bright light and um, guide humanity to better life. Because better life is possible. You just have to put your mind into it. So thank you for watching and uh, have a wonderful Friday and a wonderful weekend. Bye.